And this is the video I put. This is my video based on bleach. It's going to be completely bleach, entirely bleach. Um, I'm recording this on the 26th of December, the day after Christmas, and yesterday, Christmas, bleach's final chapter, or bleach's uh, well, final chapter of the year came out. And I reviewed it today. I'm I so the review of it's already recorded. I don't know where, if it's going to go up before or after this, but the review of it is already recorded. All right, so I just have to upload it whenever I get around to it. Um. <clears throat> so yeah, and it is the last chapter of the year. So I thought I'd make this video based on my retrospect on what happened in Bleach. Like what I, what my opinion on what happened in Bleach in the Bleach manga, like in the year past, 2013, and what I think, like I want to see in in 2000, in 2014. So, yeah. So let's see here. Really fucking good. Uh, all right, I I really did. All right, Bleach in 2013. It's like there we there's so much that happened. We had the freaking Kenpachi and Uno Hana stuff. We had the actually first and sec well the first assault on, on the Soul Society continuing and the second assault beginning. Actually, not too long ago, really. <clears throat> all right, we saw all sorts of interesting stern Raiders and one lame ass one mask de masculine all right and we oh my god so much happened in bleach this year we saw we got, got a glimpse of the world we saw ichigo training when the truth to in hollow ichigo so much happened it was so good, and now just in this last chapter, and the chapter that's... He's obviously at least... I might even say he might even be higher than Captain Level. Or than your standard Captain Level, rather. Who wants to bet he maybe he's stronger than... He might actually be stronger than him, though. I'm not really going to get into that again, but if you want to know, post in a comment below, and I'll... I'm not really getting into that right now, though. Uh, anyway, though, just so I was very pleased with Bleach in 2014, or, in, or I mean in 2014. Oh, Naruto, which I already did this on Naruto as well. Don't think I mentioned that yet. So yeah, but Naruto is going to end next year. We know this for a fact because Kishimo said so. However, Kubo hasn't said anything about when. I'd say he wants this to be the largest arc ever, and the Urankar arc, I'm pretty sure, was way fucking longer than this arc was so far. Alright. Just saying. So yeah, but what do I want to see from Peach in, or in 2015? Also, we got to see some uh, other Bankais, too. We got to see, and I'm still talking about this, we got to see Head Captain Bankai and the Head Captain died. <laughs> we got to see... Uh, Rose's Bankai, as of recently, we got to see more of Kenta's Bankai, even though we did it before in the Arankar arc, we didn't get to see a whole lot of it before, so we got to see more of it. I'm pretty sure that there's other characters that I'm leaving out. We got also got character deaths. We've got protagonists. We got Retsu Unohana's death. Plus, the truth about Retsu Unohana was absolutely fucking, like... Mind blowing, like really. <laughs> so, 2013 and 2014, I want to see every Captain's Bond guy that we haven't seen yet, or previous, which means you know, Love Aikawa's Bond guy, uh, Shinji Hirako's Bond guy, um, Yorobichi Shihoin's Bond guy. Kate Rahara's Bankai. Tessie's 
Tessai Tsukubishi's book, Shikai and Bankai. Oh, yeah. Yoroishi Shikai and Bankai. And then Tessai Tsukubishi Shikai and Bankai. Oh. I haven't seen either one, either one of either one of them. Alright. <laughs> and. Oh my god, what else? There's so much. In terms of Bankai's. Alright, uh, but it, well, Shikai and Bankai have all, all, all kinds of members of the Royal Court Guards, Court Guard Squads. Alright, like, I also want to see more with the Spirit King. Alright, I want to see Rukia's Bankai. I really want to see Bankai now. It's like... <laughs> Come out. Alright. Let's see here. What else? Like. I want to see Ichigo enter the. Series. I want to see him cause some major fucking damage. Also, I want to see Jushi Rose Bankai. And I want to see. Uh. Da ba da. Bankai. There we go. Shunsui's Bankai. Even though we know we're going to learn it eventually, we don't know when. So I really want to learn it in 2000, or see what it is in 2014. Alright. Remember, Kubo did state in an interview a while back that Shunsui's Bankai could have taken out uh, Transcended Aizen in one sh fucking strike. Like, seriously. Um, I also want to see the Aizen is going to be a major component in this arc later on. I really want to see his fucking Bankai. Alright. Special powers for A. Like, seriously. I actually be A for antimatter, which would allow him to destroy matter. That would be fucking awesome, but Whatever it is, I just want to see it. He's already an OP bastard. Alright. Like, really. Because he has the head captain's Bankai. He, you know, Zanka no Tachi. He has... He holy form. And he has whatever his... Like, already that makes him incredibly fucking powerful. But he also has whatever his special power is for the letter A. So it's like... He's a fucking beast now. You know, I also want to learn who the final villain in Bleach is, and what or is going to be. And what I mean by that is that a lot of people are thinking, you know, maybe it's not Juhabak, maybe it's going to be the Spirit King. You know, if that's the case, then that's fine, but I want to learn who it is before the end of the year. That doesn't mean that Juhabak has to be killed before the end of the year. Just a clarification of, you know, who the final villain is going to be, or if Juhabak is the only one pulling the strings here. Who knows? Maybe, maybe Juha Bak and the Spirit King are working together. You know, whatever the case may be. <laughs> wow, that's actually crazy to think. The, the Juha Bak and the Spirit King working together. Wow. <laughs> but still, you know, who knows? But still, I also want to see a lot more protagonist deaths because I know Kubo. He doesn't like to kill off protagonists. He doesn't like to kill off fan favorite characters, rather. Just fucking look at how many times in the series Toshiro Hitsugaya was supposed to be dead. Or look in this arc. Like, freaking Byakuya was supposed to be dead. He intended to kill Byakuya off. Byakuya got all fucked up and his Zanpakuto disappeared on him. But somehow, he lived with no explanation because there was a fan outcry. Seriously, what the fuck? Like, honestly. I, I love Byaki, all right, but I really wish that he had died, you know, not because for one thing that would have given that shit ton of revenge fuel for both Renji and Rukia, all right, you know, because Byaki is Renji's captain, obviously, and Rukia is Rukia and. Uh, Yaku are adopted, are adopted, are adoptive siblings. So yeah, 
And that also would have made to maybe because I like I said before. Now we obviously know that Renji is at least captain level, so that maybe that would or maybe higher than your standard your standard captain level. So maybe that would mean that Renji would become the captain of Squad Six at the end of the series. You know, that would actually been, have been pretty cool. Yeah, but it didn't happen. But still, I want to see a lot more major protagonist deaths. Because in this arc so far, all we got that I remember is uh, the head captain, Izuru Kira, and, Red, and Captain Umohana. So yeah, just saying. I want more. Um, <clears throat> yes, I really think that's all I... Had to say, I'm sure I could come up with more, give me enough time, but that's already a lot of shit that I want to see from, from Bleach in 2014. Um, also, I'd like the anime to return as well. Even though... What they're saying, I even, even assuming this as well, you know, the anime probably won't continue till the manga's finished, but I would like to see it because, like, look how, even if it's like the last week of the year or the first week of 2015, which is close enough anyways. <laughs> it's like, look how fucking far the manga is. You really think there'll be filler considering that the anime is also released weekly at this point. Even if it waits till like the very end of the year. Or especially if it waits till like the very end of the year. So, yeah, seriously. I know it doesn't really have anything to do with the manga in general. But I would like to see the anime continue in 2014. It probably won't, but I would still love it if it did. So, yes. That's pretty much all I have to say about what I want to see from Bleach in 2014. Obviously, like, in terms of 2013, not Bleach we have so by leaping Alright. Like, it really fucking does. Also, I want to see a whole... So yeah, so I think, this, sorry about that, I had to do something there, but anyway, so I think that's really all you need to say, so, yeah, um, I can't wait for the first chapter to, of Bleach in 2014, I don't know if it's going to be like the first week, like next week, which will be the, the Wednesday of next week will be the first of the year, <laughs> or if it'll wait till the previous week, or if Shonen Jump will just release them early, like, I really don't know release them early like on Tuesday or, or even Monday if they wanted to but which is very rare but once in a while they will release the chapters <coughs> on Tuesday yeah but anyways overall hope you enjoyed this uh thank you guys thanks for watching bye bye